Okay, y'all, it's so crazy, the stuff that I really, really be wanting in the trash. Uh, how y'all doing, first of all? It's for Lanista, getting ready to do a free find. I don't know if it's gonna be on Friday or not, but I'm just doing a free find haul. If it's on a Friday, great. If not, I appreciate y'all watching, because it's been a minute since I've done one. But this, I was really struggling trying to get. It's amazing, the stuff. And look what they put on here, don't carry anymore. Y'all see that? Okay. Uh, so they they had a dumpster load full of these and this is the only one I could grab. And for some reason, I just thought this was so pretty. It's an indoor outdoor tablecloth with an umbrella hole. Wow, so cute. Oh, this is gonna be so nice, especially with the umbrella hole. 60 by 84, but it's beautiful. And what I was trying to grab, because you can see it's got a little paint on it. We're just going to jump into the hall, y'all. But it's amazing the stuff that um, I like finding. I just love home decor. I love stuff like this. So I was really trying to struggle to get this one. And I hope, oh, it's no paint on it. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Ooh, so pretty. Look at the beautiful linens, y'all. That is so gorgeous. All of my... Um, domesticated oops my air just came on y'all hold on a minute i told y'all that we are working in my house without our central air because it went out there are no central airs replacement in america so let me turn this off it has wi-fi on here y'all where i can program it with my phone so at any rate we're working without an air conditioner it's hot so i'm gonna be really quick with this haul so sorry about that interruption i picked it up at costco's too by the way but getting back to this all of my domesticated um divas out there look how pretty this is and they say it has the umbrella hole now what's this zipper for i see a zipper on here i don't want to make this too long but i'm curious to know why is there a zipper hmm why is there a zipper, guys? Make This makes sense to me. Oh, oh, I see. You zip it around your hole. Because here's the hole here, look. So you're not feeding it through, you're just zipping it. Okay, okay, I get it. I get it. That's going to be pretty either way. And, um, oh yeah. Yeah. Cause it's long ways okay so it's in the middle i get it i get it all right so it's beautiful y'all gorgeous beautiful lemons okay that they just threw away and there were more of these in there i just could only get this one i only needed one so i hope somebody got the rest of them beautiful 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 i cannot wait to use this outdoors so pretty look at that lemon so pretty maribel can you turn tv down thank you yeah, this is real impromptu, guys. I just came on here and wanted to start sharing. Hey, I'm cleaning up. Y'all know we got renovations going on in the house, and we need this space to pull stuff out. Oh, Lord, here comes Jersey. Jersey, I didn't call you. And are you on my couch? Huh? Are you on my couch? Yeah. Okay. Y'all say hey to Jersey. And Mirabella. There's Jersey. Hey, y'all. Hi, Jersey needs a haircut. You need a haircut? Huh? There's my, uh, Mirabella. You need a haircut? Yeah, so that's that. Uh, and I went out yesterday and found this. Mirabella, you didn't even see this. Look at this one I found from all these. What's that? It's a beautiful cooler. Brand spanking new. Can y'all see it? A gorgeous cooler. My first thing I've ever found from all these 42 can rolling cooler with hand. Uh, hard liner and y'all it is in perfect condition perfect 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 look at that it's in a beautiful gray i cannot wait to sport this at the beach the girls just went to the beach the other um day and you took the older one out right but this is perfect for the beach and i don't see anything wrong with it guys yeah i don't think it was a return or anything they say you can put 42 cans of sodas in there and this does have a hard um piece in it our other one is just made out of this material i don't know how that's going to work but it does have the hard casing in it so yeah gray uh it's from adventure ridge it's got a bunch of zippers on here also and all of them work look at that 
lined in that also. Love it, love it, love it. Now, I don't know the retail price on this. Uh, I'll try to pull one up online maybe. But again, this came from Aldi's. This is the first thing that I have ever found from my Aldi. Something just told me to go back there and look, and I'm so glad that I did. Okay, all the little wheels are on it. It just makes me want to go to the beach and, um, you know, have some fun. Okay, I found these from Burlington. I just popped my head in there one day and found some um, placemats. A pack of four. These were $6.99. A pack of four placemats. Uh, metallic, wipe clean with a damp cloth. But y'all seen these. Okay. And I'm trying to figure out why they got rid of these. There's nothing really wrong with them. Maybe right here. Maybe because it's a little humped up right here. I'm not sure. But yeah. So cute. Pretty silver and tan. Okay. And then these little burping cloths were in... Um, that same dumpster where I got those from Burlington. So cute. Just pretty little colors. They look like they might be for a little boy. But a cute little gray one. Look at that one. Look at this one with little owls on it. This one has little arrows. And another gray one. So maybe it was packaging for these. They just came out of their package. And then this gray one. Okay, so cute. I got this from Home Sense. No. Home Goods. And it's a cute little vase with the little legs. Now, one of the legs was missing, but if I take it off, I think it would still be cute. Okay. Yeah, the legs screw on and off. But it's just a clay. Uh, just a clay little pot. It would, it would be cute if I had both legs, but again, I'm not real particular about stuff like this. Sit this out on a patio or on a shelf somewhere. It's a beautiful white pot, very earthy, giving me a, um, you know, urban vibe. If I had to guess, compared to prices 35, so this probably was about 20, 19.99 maybe or 24.99. Can I see the price? Oh, 19.99. I was right. Compared to price on this is 19.99. So I'm just going to take the legs off and uh, use it. But it's not cracked or anything. Just missing a leg. But I can make that work. Yep. So we have that. But this is one trip to um, Bed Bath and Beyond. These are solar bright disc. This lights, there are eight LED lights in each little panel. And they go in the ground like stakes. Yeah, so four of those. And perhaps this got, maybe this was packaging. I don't think it's ever been open. No, it has never been open. And then here are some uh, panels. I found two of these. But these are the hookless hangs in seconds. And I guess this goes in a bathroom? Yeah, I guess like a shower. Okay, so maybe somebody opened it, but I have one in cream and one in white. Okay. And oh, I see why it says hangs in seconds. Look at the uh, hooks, guys. It has like a little slit through it. Look at that. So it just goes through the slit. Isn't that cool? I've never seen that before. And I guess since that's rubber, maybe these go in a bathroom. I'm not sure. Yeah, but that's cute. I like the little sheer at the top and then it goes to like a waffle print here all the way down. So that's one in cream. And here's one in white. Now they sprayed the package with the orange paint. Let's make sure none of it got on it. Look at that, perfect. No orange got on that at all, guys. So nice, love it, love it, love it. And most of the time I look up the price for you guys. I'll try to look up the prices for those discs and those curtains. Now, this has never been open. This is a one, uh, it's one king tailored bed skirt, 18 inches drop. And it looks like that. It's in a pretty yellow. Y'all remember the yellow uh, comforter set that I had um, that I put on the guest bedroom? This might look nice upstairs, but it's a king. My bed upstairs is a queen, so I might just leave this in the package. 
and make good use of it uh, without even taking it out of the package because this is really, really nice. Very nice, guys. Yeah, so I got that. And then I found these. These are pretty. Look at these cushions. Okay, now they got them with the spray paint here. Uh, I guess I could try to get it out, but hey, flip it and it's good to go. But a beautiful cushion, a set of two. Now this one got hit with the spray paint here. Wait a minute, let's see. Well, got hit with the spray paint here. Y'all can see that. Nothing on this side. And then this one, there's nothing on it. So this one's perfect. Yeah. Another pair of curtains, y'all. Okay. And they're fine. I took them out of their package because they were wet. Um, they were wet. The They had just spray painted these. But there are two panels here. And it's in a beautiful uh, cream and silver. If you can see that, it has a silver undertone. Can y'all see that? Yeah. I found these hangers. They are slim grip. Found some coffee, French vanilla. And this is from Green Mountain. And what's the uh, date on these? Oops. Open package. Y'all, the best buy date on these, April 2023. Yeah. Okay. But some K-Cups. Hey. French vanilla coffee. Oh. I kind of hate that I didn't get the um, box for this. Y'all, this is a Ninja. Uh, they say an air fryer, air roast, air broil, bake dehydrate, keep warm, toast, bagel. So it's a big um, air fryer, but it looks like a, um, what do you call it? Oops, hold on a minute. It's, it's kind of heavy. But at any rate, it came out of the packaging, y'all. And then let me show y'all this also. Um, it came out of the package, but look at this. I should have gotten the box. The box was damaged. I think that they just got rid of it because of the box being damaged. But all of this came with it. It's never been used. Those are the inserts. And I almost didn't grab this. I'm glad I kind of went back and saw what it was because I was just so happy that they didn't cut the cord on it. And if I get a chance, I'll show you a picture of it, what it looks like in the uh, package. But this is gonna be neat, okay? I think I might keep this for myself. But look at that. Wow, it's huge, first of all. The cord is still attached. It's heavy as all get out. The cord is still attached, y'all. Some more kitchen stuff. Look at this. Okay. And we'll see what that is, because I'm curious to know what that is. It hasn't even been opened yet. But this is so nice. I wanted to open. This is from, again, um... Bed Bath & Beyond. It is a cutlery block set. And with the new kitchen, it would be great to have some new knives, right? Again, the box got hit with paint. Let's see um, if the product is perfect. And the last one, look at this, y'all, the last knife. It looked like a real, maybe a fish knife, maybe cutting fish with, I'm not sure, I'll look it up. I thought it was a paring knife, but I love that, you know, edging on it. And again, it's from our table, the last knife. And y'all, I had them all, beautiful. Perfect for my brand new kitchen, right? Now, come on, y'all. That's why I don't think I'll ever stop. I know I have slowed down a lot, but just peeking on days when I don't even feel like it, like the Aldi, just peeking and finding that cooler for me to use at the beach and this perfect for my kitchen. I mean, I needed new knives and this is perfect, right? So nice. Yeah, and all of them are there, guys. The scissors, okay, all of the little steak knives, the different bread knives, you know, just perfect. Okay, now this is from Crooks. 
got the little manual. Oh boy. Oops, 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 oops. Oh, look at this bad boy. Wow, this has never even been open, y'all. This has never been open. Look at this, wow. Okay, oops, so here's the bottom, the base. I love the chic, um, what do they call it, like a brush nickel on here. Look at that. Okay, never been used, look at that. Okay, still smells new as they say. Cord still attached, perfect. Never been used. And guess who needs a new blender? Me. And because, again, my appliances technically won't be seen out on the cabinet, I don't care about the color, okay? My, my kitchen has more of the gold tones, but whatever. Isn't that nice? Isn't that beautiful? All right. Or maybe saving that for Magnolia's first place, you know? BPA-free. So cute. Love it, love it, love it. Ugh, oh, wow. And the price on that, y'all... I'll put a side screen, I'll split me in half, and then y'all look over here at the price and tell me, should I stop doing this? Or would, do you think I'll ever stop doing this? How about that? Yeah. So that's this one. Okay? Love it. And then, if getting one blender is not enough, I'm not real familiar with that brand, Crux, if I'm pronouncing that correct. But this brand I am familiar with. This is a Black & Decker. They did hit this with spray paint, but I'm willing to bet you they got rid of it because of packaging. Again, if you're in the store and you see this on the shelf, would you buy it? I know I probably wouldn't. I would get the one that's not broken because you, you figure it's been bumped and bruised. Look at the packaging, okay? But y'all, they package these things so great. Look, never been used. It's still new. I'm looking at it, y'all. This has never be, even been open. Look at here. Look. So I have two blenders. Perfect. Still in the plastic. The little manual. I'm opening it up because I want to make sure if the cord wasn't cut. And I know it wasn't, y'all, because guess what? This is still just folded in here. Look at that. Look. The glass is still... Look at that. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. Here's the top. Yep. So I have two blenders. I'll figure out what I'm going to do with it. And where's the cord? I want to make sure the cord's there. Yeah, that's what I want to open it for. Look, the cord is still just inter intertwined in there. Look at that. Look, the cord is still has a little thing on it. That was because of packaging. And I'm so glad I was there to get it. Wow. Okay. We're going to put this back. So two blenders. And I'll split the screen again and show you over here uh, the price of it. Because I like showing the price because I'm frugal. Uh, I saved so much money, y'all. I was having a conversation this morning with my oldest daughter on the amount of money I have saved and how much I've earned, not even necessarily saving, how much I've earned on finding stuff from the trash and how much, you know, the, the act of just taking it out of the waste stream, if that wasn't enough to be able to, A, make money with it, give it away, take it to somebody who can use it, whatever, anything beats going in the trash for a brand new merchandise. Brand new blender in the trash. Yeah. And how many people are going on diets who need a blender, who can't afford a blender? And I'm finding them in the trash. Okay. Now, we're going to go with this next because it's not... Well, let's go with... Well, I'll go with this one. This is an online sale. Yep. A beautiful curtain rod. And again, it's in bronze. Okay. Uh, one inch rod, 48 to 84 inches. Bronze. Here are the little hooks for the actual, you know, to sit in. And let's see if the finials are down here or the other piece of it. Look at that. Yep. Nice and heavy, cute. I'll put the price somewhere. And I have two of those. Now I'm getting away from the darker colors in my home. 
But something like this would be beautiful, you know, in this room, especially when I was, you know, my cherry wood furniture, my big uh, china cabinet, and all of that. But I'm kind of getting away from that, guys. I've been um, feeling myself and my decor changing. There we go. Okay, so I have two more items, I think. Yeah. And one is this. Now, I don't think I'm going to be able to put this up. But, y'all, this is a umbrella cabana. And I'll do I'll do a picture somewhere with this, okay? And I, pro I don't think it, there's anything wrong with this. Five by eight cabana. It's fast and easy to set up. Wide openings for easy access and pockets for storage. But this is so cute to go to the beach with. You make your own little cabana. But I want to see if the inside was hit with any paint. And I don't think it was. Now, I don't think this has ever been used uh, because here in the, sh if you know, like I know, when you go to the shore, sand gets everywhere. There's no sand falling out of nothing with this. But yeah, I think this is perfect. And I'll let you guys know if it isn't. And I might even go uh, try to put it up for you guys. No, I won't. I'm not doing that. But again, we're going to let go and let go with this one. I think this is perfect. Again, I'll put the information up on the side to let you know how much it was, but I'm glad to get it. Okay, so that's that. And is that it, guys? Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Is that, oh, this back here. I got this big beach umbrella, and I will, I will, big beautiful beach umbrella. The only thing that's missing on this, guys is the bottom piece that you click in and i have plenty of those outside if i want to do a black and white uh theme but it's a beautiful beach umbrella okay in black and white now i don't have the uh base for this one so i just kind of have it propped up in my tree y'all this is actually a solar light which has a little solar powered lights where's a little switch a little switch right here and y'all see it turning on and off yeah so that's that, guys. Y'all take care. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.